Hi y'all, it's Beth here and today I am sharing with you a what I melted video and I have melted a couple of things. I haven't finished anything up yet. As you can tell, my voice is super hoarse so I'm so sorry about that but hopefully you guys can forgive me. I just am doing a lot of talking all the time and yeah, that's why my voice is just so tired. Um, anyways, first off I have Super Tarts Rosalie, and this one is Peppermint and Coconut Cream Pie. I melted two cubes in my hot plate warmer in my bedroom, and it smells really, really good. It lasted for about two nights, so not a super long time, but not a super short time either. I would say that both nights probably added up to about 24 hours ish so yeah this scent was good i'm not sure if i would repurchase it or not but i'm definitely going to enjoy it while it lasts and then i will make a decision it's a fairly good performer in my bedroom another one that i melted in the bedroom is super tarts glossy and this one is cotton candy and double mint gum. I melted two cubes in my bedroom as well. Um, this is the one that I have going currently. And it smells really good. Lasts for about two nights. And um, just smells like really, really minty. It's definitely like a spearmint gum type scent. So um, if you don't like spearmint... You probably wouldn't like this one, but I enjoy it. It's nice for the bedroom. Again, I'm not sure if it's one I would repurchase or not, but it is just nice. You know, it's just nice um, to have it while I have it. And then from that Smell Good shop, I have the scent Cinderella. And I have this one going in my bathroom. And it smells really good. I love it. It's just like... A clean linen like laundry type scent I know it's our pink sugar lavender and linens I probably will finish this one up in my bedroom in a couple days and um, then I will be on to my 36 pack in this scent because I do have a 36 pack of that scent as well since it's a scent that I really really enjoy and then from Rose Girls, I have the scent Monster Cookie. This one I melted in one of my rooms downstairs, and it did so amazing. I love this scent. I am um, going to put it in a bag of wax that I'm planning to send off to a friend, though, because I just, I'm ready to have a fresh start with my wax. And so I'm happy I gave this one a try and then I can pass it along. But when I'm purchasing a lot of vendor wax again and I see um, Jenny restock this scent, I would definitely repurchase it because it's amazing. This next scent is from Up North Creations. It's in the scent Baking with Grandma. And this does so well, even with just one cube. It smells so good. It's just a nice bakery scent. It definitely, like if you're a seasonal melter, it would be more for fall. I don't want to say that it has spices in it, but I'm not sure exactly what it is I'm smelling. It's not spices and it's not maple. But it's just something about it that like if I did have to melt seasonally, um, I would definitely categorize it as a fall scent. So that's Baking with Grandma from Up North Creations. I love it. I definitely will repurchase it when I'm done with it. Then from the Melted Mousse, I have the scent It's Fall, Y'all. This one is Autumn Flannel Leaves and Toasted Marshmallow. This was from a custom... Wait, was it part of my custom order or was it that restock that I participated in. I can't remember. It was either a custom order or a like fall ready to ship or something. 
and I received it in August of 2021. So it's over a year old and you can definitely tell because it's not as strong as it once was. But I still do love this scent. Um, definitely I get the leaves in there. Um, so yeah, I do enjoy this scent. I would definitely repurchase it. Um, you know, I would just repurchase it closer to the time that I'm going to melt it. And then last but not least is Sensi's Baked Apple Pie. And the reason why I'm trying to focus on this one is because I am getting a brick of it in my Sensi Club order for October. And so I just want to make sure that I have used up the bar by then. So yeah, this one is definitely a very spicy baked apple pie scent. And I melted um, two cubes the first time and two cubes this time. So that leaves me with four cubes left. So I think the next time I melt this one, I'll just melt it in both places downstairs. And that way then it'll be done. So yeah, that's everything that I've been warming lately. Um, I'm not sure. I don't remember the dates exactly, but I will um, put the dates, the date range of when I've been melting these things in the title of the video. And then also, I am having an online Scentsy party until December. So um, if you're planning on placing a Scentsy order, you definitely don't have to do it through my party link. But I would definitely appreciate it if you did. I will be leaving it in the description box down below. Totally up to y'all. You know. Just in case if you were planning on placing an order. And I will be um, posting my haul video soon of that. Just have to give my voice a little rest before I film it. So yeah. I'll see you guys next time. As always make sure you stay positive till then. Bye.